The story begins with a girl named Holly sitting with her father and both siblings having dinner. Holly's father was serving food to both children, but he completely ignored Holly and didn't give her any food at all. The reason was that Holly had suddenly become invisible some time ago. No one could see her except her mom because Holly's mom was someone who could feel her daughter's presence. When Holly's mom arrived, she fed her daughter and no one could see her in this way. Whatever happened, Holly remained very happy with her mom, but as time passed, Holly's mom also started to feel unwell because she had been diagnosed with severe cancer. Within a few years, Holly's mom also passes away. Now she was completely alone because there was no one who could feel her. Holly was present with her father and siblings, but no one could see her. In a way, she didn't exist for them. When Holly went to school, no child reacted upon seeing her. All they knew was that there was a girl named Holly in their class. Due to all these strange things, Holly fell into severe depression. As time passed, Holly grew up, but her family members had converted her room into a storeroom because they didn't understand that Holly was still a family member. Holly's elder brother had a great interest in videography, so he had set up his entire setup in the basement. Holly's sister got married and was happy with her husband, and Holly's father was still working as an accountant. Holly was very happy about her family, but she felt wrong that she wasn't with them. Now Holly knew that no one could see her, so she started to take advantage of her invisibility. She started working as an invisible reporter for many news channels, providing photos of affairs and breaking news to the news reporting company, and in return, she received a lot of money. Holly had completely stopped feeling ashamed now because no one could see her, so why bother maintaining discipline? Many times, she would start roaming in public places without clothes because she wasn't afraid that someone would see her. Quietly, she would take photos of people and sell them at a good price. In other words, Holly was taking advantage of her invisibility. Now, as always, Holly went inside the club to take some pictures. She was walking around everywhere, hoping to meet some celebrities and sell their pictures. But then she encountered a security guard named Shane. It was astonishing because Shane could see Holly completely. He told Holly that she couldn't enter under any circumstances. Holly was shocked that this man could see her after her mother, she hadn't met anyone who could see her. That's why now Holly tried to talk to Shane to understand how he could see her. But Shane outright refused to talk to her and asked her to leave. Holly couldn't understand how Shane could see her, and at the same time Shane's face seemed familiar to her. When Holly reads a magazine, she realizes that Shane is one of those people who was caught in a relationship with actresses and his photo was leaked, not by anyone else, but by Holly herself, by taking and sending the photos to the reporting company. Now, Holly starts to inquire more deeply about Shane, and she learns that Shane was a very professional MMA player who had made his mark in fighting and had risen to the top. After gaining so much fame and name, everyone knew Shane. He also started a relationship with a very beautiful model, but here comes the entry of Holly, who took advantage of her invisibility and leaked many photos of Shane and his girlfriend. These photos were very obscene. When the reporting company published all these things, Shane became very infamous. All of Shane's fans started to hate him, and the issue escalated to the point where Shane and his girlfriend broke up because of all these things. Shane fell into such deep depression that he couldn't even fight properly, and due to losing international matches so badly, no one called him to play any further matches. Since then, Shane's name and fame started to decline rapidly. People started forgetting about him, and he stopped getting any work. Today, Shane is working as a security guard. Holly knows very well that whatever happened with Shane, it was solely because of her mistake. If she hadn't taken photos while being invisible, Shane wouldn't be in this situation. That's why now Holly decides that she will somehow restore Shane's name and fame. Holly goes straight to Shane, telling him that no one except him can see her. Holly shows Shane the magazine and tells him everything, explaining that it's because of her that he's in this situation. She declares that she has decided to restore his lost respect. Shane thinks that Holly is just fooling around and not taking her seriously, so he doesn't pay much attention to her and asks her to leave. But Holly insists, requesting him to give her a chance to prove her abilities. However, Shane has no time for all these things as he heads straight to a club to meet his manager, hoping to arrange another fight and earn some money. Holly follows him closely. Shane's manager arranges the next fight and discusses the payment. Holly, now near Shane's manager, starts checking his mobile to see what type of deal and money he is setting up. Shane is completely unaware of what's happening. He can't understand why his manager isn't reacting upon seeing Holly. All these things seem very strange to him. Now, the manager informs Shane about the date of the fight and tells him about the money. 
Meanwhile, Holly, from behind, is telling Shane that his manager has disclosed a lower amount of money to him. Holly tells Shane the exact amount of money he will receive for the fight, which boosts his confidence. Shane starts questioning his manager about how he found out about all these things. After the truth comes out, the manager has no choice but to offer Shane the same amount of money that Holly mentioned. Holly has indeed helped Shane a lot. After they leave, Shane still can't believe that Holly can't be seen by anyone else. To prove it, Holly steps in front of a car that's approaching them rapidly. The driver stops the car just in time, bewildered as to why Shane is standing between the cars. He hadn't seen Holly at all. Now, even Shane starts to trust that Holly is indeed invisible. Holly explains that there must be some reason why they can see each other, and they should help each other to solve their problems. After thinking for a long time, Shane invites Holly to his house the next day to discuss further. Holly agrees, and the next day, she goes directly to Shane's house. Seeing Shane's well-built body surprises her. There's a dog in Shane's house, but Holly can't see it, which makes Shane realize that Holly is indeed invisible to everyone except him. As they walk and talk, Shane shares some things about himself with Holly. Shane was explaining that in his childhood, his stepfather kicked him out of the house and since then he had been wandering alone. He had survived in this place in very difficult ways, so he had started fighting to make himself strong. He had been fighting since then and even today because fighting is his life. If that doesn't remain, he won't be able to live well. Now, Holly had gone to see a small fight of Shane, which had a prize money of only $300. Holly felt very bad to see that Shane, who fought in big MMA fights, was now fighting in a street fight for $300. Shane won that fight and got $300, but Holly was asking Shane why he was fighting such small fights. She was telling him that he should fight with big fighters to regain his respect. Shane replied that he didn't want to fight any fighters and even if he did, the organizers wouldn't take my tickets due to my bad reputation. Shane had gone into a lot of depression from this. Now, Holly wanted to help Shane in any way she could, so she started researching about big fighters. That's when Holly found out about a fighter who had recently been involved in a drugs case. Due to many contacts, he was humiliated. Now, Holly knew all about those drugs that the fighter had consumed, and she had cleverly gathered a lot of information and even took many photos of that fighter by taking advantage of her invisibility. Holly started blackmailing the other famous fighter, telling him that if he didn't fight Shane, she would expose all his dark deeds in front of everyone. This included photos of him consuming different types of drugs that Holly had taken at his house. The famous fighter became very scared of all these things. Now, Shane was talking to Holly about some of his old days, how he had worked hard and won so many matches, becoming a top-level MMA fighter. Then Shane received a call from the manager of that same famous fighter saying that their fighter was ready to fight Shane and it would be a grand premiere with many people coming. Shane was very happy that he finally got a chance. This was the same fighter who had refused Shane some time ago but now he agreed due to Holly's blackmailing and threats. Shane was not happy with this but now he was busy preparing for his match, leaving everything behind. The whole fight was being discussed everywhere so now Shane also doubled his training so that he could win this match. The day had come when Shane's fight with the famous fighter would happen. Everyone was cheering for the famous fighter because no one trusted that Shane could win. The fight started and both were giving each other a tough competition. Although Holly wanted to watch Shane's fight up close, there were too many people there, so she decided to watch the match on TV. This fighting match dragged on for a long time with Shane dominating quite well. In the end, during the result, it was revealed that Shane had won the fight. Holly was very happy about this. The dirty name that was hanging over Shane was slowly fading away and people started liking him again. When Shane finished his match and returned home, Holly was sitting outside. Shane thanked her, saying thank you and expressed that perhaps his good luck charm was bringing positive things along with him. Holly was also very happy for Shane. However, after thinking a lot, Shane asked Holly about the secret of her invisibility and why she had become invisible. Holly felt that Shane was being rude by asking her that question because no one, not even her mom, had asked her about it until then. Holly got very angry about it, but Shane tried to explain that he had no such intention and just as he was about to leave, he grabbed her hand and kissed her very lovingly. It seemed like Shane was falling in love with Holly in some way. Now we see Holly who was completely confused what to do next, she wanted to do something for her family, so Holly goes directly to her house. She found out that her elder sister hadn't told her husband about her pregnancy yet and she didn't have the courage to tell her husband so Holly directly went and threw the pregnancy kit in front of her husband. 
Seeing this, her husband understood that she was pregnant. Holly's sister was also very happy about this. Now Holly goes to her brother, whose computer had a lot of photos of a girl. Holly finds out that her brother loved a girl a lot, but he didn't have the courage to talk to her, so Holly immediately goes to that girl and kicks her, causing her brother to come running and now some things start between them. That is, Holly also helped her brother now. Now she goes to her father, who had tears in his eyes as he remembered his deceased wife by looking at her photo. Holly then goes with her father to the same graveyard where her mother's grave was. She puts flowers on top of it, giving peace to her wife's soul. Holly also goes there and hugs her father, after which she starts going towards Shane's fight. Shane was getting badly beaten by his opponent in that match. He wasn't as weak as he thought he was. After hitting many punches, Shane was becoming unconscious. When Holly found out about all this, she immediately rushed to the stadium and entered the fighting area to give Shane courage. She holds Shane's hand, saying, I am with you and you can definitely win this match. Astonishingly, Holly, who was completely invisible, now started to become visible to everyone. All the security guards were thinking when did this girl go inside. Holly is quickly taken out of the stadium due to the lack of any ticket and because of this, the security guards are taking her away to the other side. Shane, who had lost the match due to a lack of points, is now becoming unconscious. Shane directly goes to Holly and tells the security guard that she is with me. Shane realized that Holly is his true love and now Holly was visible to everyone. That is, he had learned to overcome his ability or curse. Shane gets into a good relationship with strength. Everything gets sorted out. Holly also goes in front of her father, who was very happy to see her for the first time. He hugs Holly with happiness, and in this way, our imaginary story ends here. And if you liked my explanation, then please like the video and subscribe to the channel. See you in such entertaining videos until then, goodbye.